This is the Srika RGB LED floor lamp. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get the user manual. They give you an Allen wrench, some rubber feet for it, a screwdriver, a double stick tape pad. There is a remote for it right here. Over here are the feet for it, or the legs for it, if you will. I haven't taken out of this, any of this out of the plastic yet. I will shortly. And the light comes in three tube sections. They are numbered, so you want to put them together in the order that's there. On the lamp itself is a little control box where you can set it up and do a couple different things with it right there. Plugs in USB, power adapter not included, and right there is your infrared receiver for the remote control. Let me go ahead and put this together. It's pretty simple as far as attaching the lights together. You can see the LED strip inside there like that and these pins here when you line everything up with the next section you just make sure the pins on that plug together in there and then everything will be assembled. Put the legs on and you're all set. So assembly is really easy. The instructions don't tell you much, but it's not really a big deal. There's two screws already installed on this piece. And you just loosen them, and it slips on. There's a piece that sticks out from here. And then you see there's a big hole, and a big hole right there. And that bolt with the Allen wrench goes through the bottom and into the bottom of this. And then you fit together the other lamp sections. So here is the lamp assembled, and it is too tall for the area that I have <laughs> right here. So we're, of course, going to put this in a different location, but I'll just give you some preliminaries with it here and now. You can mount the light this way or turn it 180 degrees, but then you kind of lose the corner of your room. So I'm going to leave it like this for now. I think that's going to work better in my particular case although the wire will come out the front, but you could just route it out around the back, it's fine. Um, like I said, you have your control panel there and a remote as well. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, tell you a little bit about the lamp first. This lamp stands approximately 52 inches tall, so about four and change feet or so. And, um, you know, it can sit in the corner of a room and it has many, many, many different RGB lighting modes. In fact, 121 of them. And the light can achieve up to 1500 lumens at the highest brightness. And there are 10 different brightness levels. Let me go ahead and just kick it on. And immediately you can see some pretty cool colors. Now, the camera does not seem to be doing the best with that, but it is, in, you know, certainly RGB like you would expect. In real life, it looks great. You can just use the little box here if you want. Press the mode button, and now we have a different mode, as you see. I'll press again. Now we have yet another one where you'll get colors coming down that way, and it'll keep strobing through those. And you have this mode here, and there are many, many, many different modes, which of course we're going to get into a little bit later. So you can have fun playing with the buttons right on the box there, or if you want, you can use the remote. So you can turn it off if you want, it goes off, turn it on, it remembers the mode it was in, and you have a speed button, so now it's at the maximum speed like that and of course you can slow that down to that slow if you wanted so far this is pretty cool indeed and of course you have your modes here so if you wanted to change to another mode you have all of those and you can keep selecting through those all different cool stuff like that And it just goes and changes colors, and you can have fun with that. You can do solid colors. You can do red. You can do green. You can do blue. You can do yellow. And you can also do white, just like that. So it has 
all of those things built in. There's also a timer here for different settings, so it'll turn off after that. And there's even a music mode as well. So we'll get into that a little bit later. You have your brightness here. We can lower the brightness. That's now the lowest. It'll flash. When it flashes at you, that means that's, you know, the extreme end. Or we can brighten it up. And that's as bright as it gets. So there you go. You can play around with that all day. And again, if you wanted the different modes, you know, whatever suits your fancy, that one's pretty cool. There's just so many different things that this can do as you go through it here. You know, like I said, with 121 different modes, <laughs> you, you're going you're gonna to be sitting there for a while just picking the one you like. That's really nice just as it is. And then you have green up and down, blue up and down, yellow, different colors up and down. That's really nice. The camera, like I said, unfortunately is washing a lot of this out. I don't know if I get a closer shot, if it'll show the colors more vibrantly. Yes. So you can see them as they go by there. Like that. I'll switch modes. Yet again. That's really nice. The red, green, and blue. Christmas time. Can't beat that. I mean, that's that's something that you just people just don't have that. This you don't see. That's really nice. Blue and yellow, that's nice. So there are many, many different modes. But of course, it does more. That's right. It is Wi-Fi enabled, so you can, if you wanted a more low-tech approach, to control it with an app. And it uses the Tuya Smart app. I'm going to get all of that set up. As far as setting that up, that's going to be beyond the scope of this video. But the uh, user manual does tell you how to set that up. It pretty much sets up like any other smart device you might have. So let me go ahead and get that all set. Now, although it works with the Tuya Smart app, it also works with the Smart Life app. And that's a very important thing because a lot of people have those Wi-Fi plugs where you can have a voice assistant turn them on and off and stuff like that. And it's all built in and set up on my system with that. So that's going to make it real easy for later. But it has different modes right in the app. There's the film mode, which I've already selected here. That's kind of plain. Dating. So we can do that. It kind of gives sort of an orangey, pinkish light. Let me shut that. So you get that. And there are other ones here. Sunset. Christmas Eve. And that's just some of them there. You can go into other ones. There's uh, Colorful, for example where it'll flash different colors like that. So many different scenes. There's a dynamic one. So it can flash like that and do different things. Dream. We'll select. There we are. It's kind of a dream sequence looking thing. I get it. Marquee. There's rainbow. And indeed, it is green. Heading up and blue, and it's going to start changing and doing its thing as it will. So that's one of the things you can do. And there are all kinds of other stuff you can set up here as well. You can select different segments and the colors and all different stuff. You can set a timer and a schedule and also adjust the length of this. Now the length is set, so don't mess with it, but it's there. And of course, you can turn it on and off, you know, using the uh, app right here without having to use the remote. But yet, of course, there's more. In an effort to keep this video as short as possible, I'll just give you a quick demo with the voice assistant. Alexa, turn on the magic lantern. 
Okay. Alexa, turn off the magic lantern. Okay. So that's just a quick example, of course. You can do a lot more. And now the piece de resistance. The music mode. I'm going to turn this on, go into music mode, and I'm going to play a copyright-free song. I'll go through the different modes as it goes. So once again, this was the Srika RGB LED floor lamp. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find the item available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.